I'm absolutely blessed to have such a beautiful facility like this. I'm thankful for Pete and his family for, you know, uh, raising awareness for such an important cause. What's up everybody? I'm Chris Markovich. I'm a junior outfielder on the Boston College baseball team and today I will be showing you the Pete Frady Center. Come on. So this is where we spend most of our time working on our hitting. We have, I believe, eight cages. We use around five of them. Softball uses the other three. Countless machines in here. This is where we work on our most important craft I believe in. I mean, we spend, gotta be around four hours a day up here. This is, this is our bread and butter. We absolutely love this spot. I'll come show you more. We got some fellow players hanging out, getting ready to hit. Here's fifth year senior, Barry Walsh, the captain of the outfield. Absolutely stellar job. Great hitter, great defender. He'll probably be on a pro team someday in the future, so make sure you get his baseball card. And there's uh, Parker Landwehr in the back. Stud catcher, so much juice. Hits the ball to the park at a crazy rate. Absolutely love the kid. Let's go. We'll head downstairs. This is where the cool stuff is. How we doing? This is, this is Coach Soul. We call him the ball hawk captain. He's my outfield coach. Nice. Well, probably he's gonna my be, outfielder. <laughs> probably so. going to be the best man in my wedding one day. We don't know. Nice. Well, but, hold, and now that it's in recording, I hold you to that. Okay. Now. Sounds but, good. But hey, coaches are only as good as the players you buy into the commitment, right? There we go. So, all that? right, man, you showing them around? I am. Awesome. All right, Absolutely. well, great seeing you guys. See you later, coach. This is our weight room. Shout out our strength coach, Will Franco, for getting us right. He got me abs last year, so I'm forever in debt to him. But uh, this is this is where we, we get our gains in. And then over here, sports medicine. This is when we're not feeling so well. We come in here and get right. Uh, our trainer, Phil's a great guy. He uh, helps us out for sure. And we come down here. This is the equipment room. This is our guy, Jake, in here. He does a tremendous job. He's the man. Love him. Lighting up some baseballs for today. Yeah, yeah. And this is the coolest part of the Pete Frady Center. So in bird ball, we got our core values up on the wall. We come in here every day, we read these, we understand you know, what our mission is. We're all driven in the same direction. Absolutely love this place, love this picture. You know, all of us together, it's super awesome. And of course you got freight train, strikeout ALS, the, the flag. The, you know the reason we have all this it's the reason we play so you know, we're totally pumped to have this here beautiful locker room absolutely love it in here this is where the guys spend most of their time uh, we got music everything you want you know, we got a couple uniforms out people didn't clean up but it's all right this is the nicest spot i believe in the facility i absolutely love spending time with my buddies in here we'll uh head back out to the field and i'll show you around Oh. Showing them the field, yeah, nice. come on. <laughs> so this is the walk we usually take out to the field on game days. We'll come out here usually early before any fans get here just to get some pre-work done on the field. Um, we'll usually walk through here, as you can see. We didn't have this a few years ago. We were stuck at Shea Field. Um, but through generous donations, we were able to install turf, which is a lot nicer with the cold weather we get up in Boston. Um, we also have stadium seating. We, uh, we broke a record last year for most attendance at a BC game um, against Duke. It was, uh, it was pretty unbelievable. It was, uh, it was awesome. So here, we'll take, we'll take a walk down to the field. We usually stop here with our buddies, you know, give them one last hug before you walk into the field and lock in. You kind of get all your, your goofiness out here and then it's business once you step through those uh, two poles. So let's go. And here we are. This is our home dugout. This is where we come out to the plate, get ready for our bats. You know, it's uh, nice having turf, beautiful field. Uh, can't wait to play more on it in the spring against other schools, so I'm excited. <laughs> 